what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back we are here once again we break yeah what can I say man <laughs> what can I say I'm gonna miss hope man I'm gonna miss hope on the show for sure for sure as my hair is dusty I know my hair looks this camera making my hair look really dirty it's not dirty okay it, <laughs> I don't know why the, the light is shining on my hair making my hair looking like you know what I'm saying like like it's dusty real dusty you know what I mean but in any case that's neither here nor there OP RIP to the one and only man I didn't know he was gonna go out like that but he did he did and it was it was a it was a a good way for a character to go out um yeah you know i'm saying they did it very well um leading up to it everything the storytelling behind it was great it wasn't just like oh he's dead huh <laughs> you know what i'm saying like what you know what i'm saying it was heartfelt they send him off in a in, in a good way and I did watch that video that um, one of my um, subscribers sent me um, I did watch that video where they were saying goodbye to him um, where where um, they used the samurai sword to cut off his beard um, dude that played Jax was crying it, it's like you actually lost the brother because you know you're not gonna be seeing him on set every day anymore so it was kind of like losing someone you're gonna miss him so um literally and figuratively so it, it's it, it was touching it was a touching moment i did see the video and it was great it was it was a good video to watch um very heartfelt video um crazy stuff but anyways thank you guys so much let's get to the reaction i will see you guys for the review I'm having a little bit of issue with my Google Drive. I don't know what's going on. It's not processing out my videos, at least not as quick as I expected to. So that happens sometime with the Google Drive. I don't know why, but for some reason, I don't know if it's like Google is just super busy or the servers are just too busy at some point or they're doing maintenance or whatever the situation is um, that could be causing the videos to take forever to um to process out to be ready so if these videos are kind of late guys um i apologize in advance but it is what it is anyways guys let's jump in see you guys for the review Alright, so we finally found out that Clay is behind the home invasions using the new guys in the Suns. Oh man. It's it, it, he's trying to bring so much heat on Jax so that he can get the presidency back. And I'm telling you, man, like Clay is just he's just a trash character, bro. Like, I hate him so much. Because he just don't know when to take a L and go sit his ass down. Ain't nobody want to see your old ass running the club, okay? Ain't nobody. Sometimes you need to use. Anytime Jax finds this out, if he, if Jax finds this out, and that's the reason why, you know, anything that Clay does, they do too, because they still hold some sort of respect for him or whatever the situation is, or maybe they are the reason why, you know, maybe Clay is the reason why they came they nomad over to the club anyways so we don't know what's going on but at the end of the day i'm looking at all of this right i'm looking at all of this that's going on tara is trying to um get otto to rescind this testimony we have you know pope putting jacks on game and let him know it's somebody inside man because if the streets don't know nothing it's got to be somebody that's close to you and, and and the thing about it is you know I said like I think it was the last reaction I did I was saying that I feel like Clay has something to do with it but I never thought he would be using dudes from the club and he kept blaming the blacks blaming the blacks blaming the blacks because he wants this beef to go down he he's oh man 
Clay, trash, bro. Tra <laughs> He's trash, man. I don't like his character in the show at all. I don't like him. Gemma, Nero's half sister, killing herself. That was two very intense episodes. Jack's going ham with the snow globe on the on the guard, the corrections officer that he promised that he was gonna kill him and stuff like that. And as I said, I'm not an advocate of, for violence. I like seeing it, but I do understand from the show's perspective why this had to happen. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, it's kind of weird because the guy that provided you with the information to kill this guy is the same guy that caused the 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 um the officer guy the 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 corrections officer to to kill Ope. So it is so weird the dynamics, but it's good story storytelling. It's good writing because you're like you're conflicted as a viewer because you're like um you're getting deeper and deeper in bed with a guy that is literally indirectly responsible for your friend's death, your best friend's death. You kill the man who really didn't really, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you really look at it, he really didn't have a choice to do it, but he's still, he, in, 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 in the overall context of things, he did have a choice. Don't get me wrong, but it's just a figure of speech, right? So he was in a position, but he never said, you see, he's saying that, oh, I had to do it, but you never said that. It seems like you enjoyed it a little bit too much because that's what I'm saying. It's just like, when you have it good, you know what I'm saying? You don't think about others, but now when you're on your knees begging for your life, that's when you realize, oh, you know what I'm saying? I did have a choice, but at the end of the day, man, it's you know everything that's going on right now it's just uh it's a credit to the writing in this show it keeps you on your toes it keeps the the legitimacy of um what do you call it the legitimacy of the club um just i don't want to say badassness because that's not a word but it, it's it, it encompasses what i'm trying to say you know, um, so it's just crazy to me sometimes when I, when I'm watching the show and I'm trying to get involved and I'm trying to, to get immersed and stuff like that. It's like that. It's in, you know what I'm saying? It's instant. So I really do like the fact that this show, as soon as I sit down and start reacting to it, like I perk up because I'm so immersed in it. Where it's like, I've, as I've told you guys before, I feel like I'm a part of the motor club and I feel like all of this is going down in my backyard. You know what I'm saying? And I'm and I'm seeing it play out. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, wow. You know what I'm saying? These guys are, they look cool. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, you know, crime, it, it looks cool until you get caught. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And it feels good until you get caught. You know what I'm saying? Um, so... It's just crazy to me, man. The stories that they're trying to tell. Gemma kind of getting... I wonder if something is going to happen. They kind of introduce a new character. And this another guy. I think this. I think she's going to sleep with this guy. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, Gemma is just... She's just on a roller coaster of everything right now. And it's just like, you want her to be steady. But at the same time, it's, it's like... Because I think Jax is planning to let him watch... Let her watch the boys while they're go going up to the cabin for a couple of days so i don't know what's going to happen but you know what i'm saying i didn't want the sheriff's wife died you know what i'm saying and it was shocking to me because i was like oh she's going to survive i guess she was bleeding out for too long maybe she lost too much blood i don't know i thought they saved her man i thought they saved her but she did <laughs> she did that was that was very shocking to me so i really do and and that's what i'm saying like i did that that came out of left field for me that they were gonna go down that route of you know all this stuff is blowing back on jackson he, he doesn't know where it's coming from and this is all clay's doing all clay's doing you know what i'm saying and i think he's eventually Jax is going to find out before the end of this season and that is when we're probably finally going to see Jax deciding to kill 
um, clay one way or the other, or maybe because, you know, even, even the Irish guy got a friendly thing, you know what I'm saying, like, you know, that's how you settle your difference, and you got something to say to me, man, say it to my face, stop all this pra passive aggressive stuff you be saying, quit that, quit that, come at me, I'm right here, I'm standing right here, come at me, bro, you know what I'm saying, so, I really do appreciate, man, them going the extra mile to get these things to get these things settled and and stuff like that inside this show because it's it's um it's entertaining but it's also ve it's a very tense entertainment suspense entertainment so i really i'm really enjoying it anyways guys thank you guys so much for tuning in as always hopefully you guys enjoy these episodes as much as i do i'm gonna try to get two more episodes done for you guys um because i promised you guys that i would do four episodes on saturday so i'm gonna try to get two more done but not in the same video um i'm not gonna you know what i'm saying like you know uh, give me some extra clicks <laughs> anyways um for you guys i know you guys are enjoying the show i am having a little bit of issue with my google drive today i might put out a community post about it because my google drive just decided to not process out my videos i don't know why it's taking so long i don't know what happened um but something went on and then i got an email about something about what they're planning to do new policies about google drive going forward it has nothing to do with copyright or anything like that it's just about their keeping data so if you don't use the drive but you have files on the drive for like for over two years after two years they just automatically erase your files from your google drive if you haven't used your google drive in a while right and the same goes for if you have if, if if you go over the storage and it's sitting if you exceed the storage and you put it there i'm gonna have to read that email thoroughly to really understand it but i did get gist of it by reading it i um i think it was while one of the episodes like i saw the email i was like does this have anything to do with what's going on but it really doesn't you know um so maybe they're trying to do some stuff with it i don't know but whatever the situation is all I know is all the files that I uploaded today on the Google Drive, none of them has been processed. And I've been, it's four o'clock in the afternoon and I've been reacting since, since six o'clock this morning. I've been reacting. So I've been uploading stuff with the Google Drive. Nothing is processed yet, which is absolutely ridiculous. That, that, you know what I'm saying? The last time that happened, it took a while for them to get back, but it is what it is. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in as always. Leave a like on the video when you get to see this. This is your boy Terabyte Reacts, and I'm out. Peace.